Hi Aquarius, welcome to your reading and this is for Aquarius Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus placement in their chart. Jupiter may also resonate with the reading. Cross watchers are always welcome. Cross watchers, if I describe someone and you know that it is not you, <clears throat> it is not you. Just because you are connecting with Aquarius, you you will assume that whom I'm describing here is you. Please don't, this is not a personal reading. And for those of you who is new to the channel, welcome. You might want to consider subscribing for I am always hosting a party online wherein I am doing a live streaming. And in the live stream, you can ask me questions. If you missed the live streaming, you can still ask me questions. There's a link in the description box. Click that link. You will be routed to my page. Type in your questions and then click submit. 500 likes for this video and your next video will be a full reading. So Aquarius, if you want to know your lucky numbers and lucky color, follow me on Instagram. If you also want to know your financial forecast, follow me on Instagram as well. If you are into twin flame readings, almost personal readings, pick a card and channel messages, might as well subscribe to the other channel. That is Timeless Tarot 111. And if you want to, if you resonate with the reading, congratulations. If you do not resonate with the reading, you can come back to the reading after a week or two. Time is fluid. If you resonate with some bits and pieces of the reading, still congratulations for I am doing a collective reading. So, career use, if you are, if you want to win a personal reading with me, watch until the very end of the video. But let's begin with your extra message. So, co-create. Um, I can sense here that you, if, if someone here is, someone here wants to, if this is their wish or this is what they want to um, do in the connection. So, someone is wishing that their person is cooperative, that their person can put some effort because I can sense here, Aquarius, that one person is just, you know, making this connection work. At least that's what I felt like. Felt that someone is putting too much effort and they feel like their, um, their partner is, you know, kind of like lazy, not, not paying attention, not putting effort, not giving them time. So I can sense it, that's how they feel. But I can see here with a co-create, little do you know, I can see your separation between them, right? The wisdom is far from, from this person. So it's, I can sense here that this person or this entity, what this energy is thinking, you know, is my person already enlightened? So I can sense your separation for a few numbers. So if you, there's an egg here, egg symbolizes new life, new beginning. I can sense here that they're about to wisdom. The owl is a wisdom, right? Knowledge. I can sense here that this person, little do you know, that they're about to achieve the enlightenment. And there's also some thoughts here that they would love to now, because of the separation, they would love to, you know, um, be responsible partner for you. But that happened because of the separation. They are already on the thin line, you know, on the edge of making a move here towards you. Again, this could be you. This could be the cross watchers. Um, you might be connecting with a Gemini or has a Gemini placement in their chart. Or they have a Gemini placement in their chart. But I can see you with the seven of swords. This is a little tricky. You know, you may not see it. You may not feel it. But this is how they feel. They, they are thinking of you. They wanted to put this connection to another level now. They are ready. But because of the Seven of Swords here, you're perceiving something. It is because they are also not showing it to you um, because of the separation probably. So someone here is waiting. Um, it's not just you. I can see you because of the co-creates here. I can sense that they are also missing you like real bad the nostalgia they are even thinking of what if uh what if if we didn't break you know what if if 
this connection still continues. Um, I can see your tower moment is happening. Again, no one can skip the tower moment. This is destined for someone needs to learn something here. It could be a learning from you, uh, for you or it could be a learning for them. But I can see here if this is a learning for them, they know. Um, I can see here that this is you or whoever I am talking here. Um, Ten of Wands, you know, you felt like this is already a burden because my person is not... It's not making a move here but the queen of wands as you can see you don't know you don't know that they are still um checking up on you probably this person also has a dummy account you don't know um they're still stalking you but that's how you feel it is you know this is a burden my purse is not coming but that is what you think because the wisdom is about to emerge the wisdom they're about to get this enlightenment with the two of pentacles here and the ten of cups see i told you they are now on the edge am i making a move um should i make a move here because this person who separated from you would love to give you this ten of cups which is the completion of your love story they are already in this i told you enlightenment three of three of pentacles this is more of you know self-realization you know studying um, trying to paint a picture I'm um, trying to figure out something and I can see here what they that what they're gonna figure out here is also that you have a soul bond with each other you might be connecting with someone that you have a, that, that, that you're a twin flame okay but let's clarify here with the seven of swords king of swords and the emperor and the temperance you might be connecting with a Sagittarius or has a Sagittarius placement in their chart or they have Sagittarius placement in their chart but I can see here that this person is also testing the waters checking if they are still welcome you know but I can see here once this person moves they're gonna protect this connection with a tower moment they are very um, slow moving energy that's why the fear is building up on you yes you still love them that's a fact but you know because of their slow movement there's a fear that is created in you or building up in you that your person is not making a move here. But this is a promise. You know, once they reach the enlightenment, they will going to be responsive and they will make the first move here. So this is your reading, um, Aquarius. If you resonate with this and you want to go in depth, you can book a personal reading with me. If you have a question or two, or a personal question there is a link in the description box click that link you will be right at my page tap in your questions click submit 500 likes for this reading and I will be doing you know a full reading with you and I hope to see you also in the other channel time Lester row 111 for you to in a personal reading with me click the like on that Aquarius video comment down below so I must see your comment from February the 1st to February the 14th. And if you miss the day, then you will be disqualified. But I can sense here that you're going to win. So good luck to you. Thank you so much for watching. Love and light to you. Namaste. See you in the next reading, Aquarius. Goodbye.